Uh, there's a video just to demonstrate uh, and explain how slide decoders work. Generally, these are much more expensive than your normal uh, decoders, uh, sort of in between sort of like the five to six hundred pound mark. Uh, they work on the same principle that if you've got a lever that is individual to the other levers, if you can identify that individuality, you've in effect identified the lever. And the way you can do that is from the position of it and how it responds uh, under a certain condition. And the way these work is if you can see they've put a, uh, a pin there in the, in the first position, as you can see, as you, as you slide it in, the pin raises. And from how it raises and what happens, we can interpret what the actual lever is. So we'll do, give a demonstration now. Obviously we're going to do the lever nearest the cap. So we've got it in the position there, put that into the lock, turn it round, and slide it in. This would be the first thing. So it right. It's actually contact at number two. Contact at two, push it forward, and it stops at two. So it will be two, contact, two, stop, is how we interpret that. And for this lock, that would be a number five. And what you then do is just move your pin to the next position go through once again, do exactly the same with it. Once you've identified all of them together, if I just quickly build the pick, obviously I've already uh, decoded this one already. Uh, there's no point really showing you all of the different ones because different locks will be different to how you do it. But uh, with this one as well, remember that your three and your five lever are exactly the same. I'll just build the pick. Once you've actually built it, so it, you put that in the lock, and that should then open your lock. Yeah. And what you can then do, obviously, put your other two pins at the other side, put that into your key machine, and then you cut your key from your pick. Hope you enjoyed.